Good morning. As we embark on this Monday, we head into uncharted territory, shifting the largest community college system in the world to an online environment in response to an event unprecedented in recent history. The Chancellor's Office has been providing details and regular updates. However, I know that there are still many questions to be answered and, to be honest, we're going to have to work together to figure out all the details. In this vein, I want to thank the faculty for engaging in the training that's necessary to shift as many classes as possible to an online environment. To the staff, I want to express my appreciation for your being here today and engaging in the vital discussion of how to shift our services to online and how we can protect your health by establishing protocols and procedures for working remotely. Your input about your job functions is vital to continuing the work of the college. I must also emphasize the importance of personal decisions related to your health. If you have a chronic condition that could be exacerbated by COVID-19, the decision is simple, stay home. For example, I personify the governor's directive from yesterday. I'm over 65 and I have asthma. Therefore, out of an abundance of caution, I have chosen to self-isolate. You need to do the same. However, I will be in full contact with the Vice Presidents and Vicky throughout the next two weeks as we make the transition to a different operating environment. So if you have any questions, please forward to Vicki and she'll get them to me. In closing, I've always boasted informally that West is best. This challenge will prove that we truly are. Thanks, everyone.